we live now in, in the 21st century, and I think at this time, the physical world has become a bit exhausted. It's become a bit banal in a way because we've done so much. In fact, the kind of entropy and, and uh, plethora of things that we have in the world are to the point where the question is whether we can actually do something new and original and if we can push any more boundaries in the physical uh, age. Everybody's creating their own MySpace, Facebooks, blogs, et cetera, et cetera. We've all become photographers, we've all become writers, we've all become critics. So the w digital age has really afforded the human spirit in a way to go back to its true essence. And its true essence is really creativity that we can all, we're born to create. And I spend my life on airplanes with a laptop really designing as if I have a physical loom. I'm making fabrics, but I'm using a kind of third order of prosthetics. I'm designing these kind of textures. And Scavolini approached me, uh, which I think, by the way, just to add, is a fantastic company. Somebody actually I've always wanted to work with, so I was kind of surprised they, they knocked on my door. And the quality of their work is fantastic. And they asked me with their crystal collection to embellish the collection to really kind of add my spirit, my, my decoration. And I think when I thought, looked at the project, I thought, well, you know, kitchens have finally become very, very refined. And Scavolini makes a very um, perfect um, kind of modernist, uh, platonic, sacred, clean kitchen. And I thought that the idea of embellishing it, the idea of me kind of getting in there and, and adding some, let's say, of my, a bit of my kind of pop, post-pop spirit in a way, was um, important because I think the kitchen in itself has represents now in the home the place, a place where you need to communicate some level of energy and inspiration. Now, when the kitchen, there's two things that go on in the kitchen, social life, parties, and, and, you know, um, and, and people kind of coming together uh, in, par in parties, you notice that people always move towards the kitchen for food, wine, etc., and hang out in the kitchen. And then there's cooking, too. And when you cook, you need to be inspired. So I think what, what better in a way to be inspired than to kind of raise the energy and the beauty and the aesthetics and the color and the fabric and the texture of the kitchen. So um, I just took some of the patterns and things that I work with, worked on, on the crystal collection, and. Uh, and this nice because glass, I think, is just such a perfect, beautiful material for the kitchen. I kind of embellished the kitchen and worked on some handles and some hoods uh, to really kind of just, you know, bring another alternative, let's say, uh, uh, a kind of more colorful, a bit more energy, let's say, into the context of the kitchen. That's how I guess I'm inspired, inspired by living.